Good morning, NPC. I'm Mr. Roar, and this is NPCNN. So, got an update for you. Friday's episode was sure a nail biter. Just got done looking at the final stats. It was tied 17 votes apiece. And so the tiebreaker boils down to who votes more on the extremes. And with 16 out of those 17 votes saying that Caden Heminger nailed it, he's moving on to the next round. Congratulations. Today's episode features number six seed and number seven seed, Serena Farrell versus Nikki Brunick. Good luck, y'all. NPCNN. Today is Monday, March 29th. And since it's still March, and March is reading month, now off to What You're Eating with Serena Farrell. Welcome back to What You're Eating, the show where we ask people what you're eating. So Tanner, what you're eating? Well, I'm reading The Martian. It is a sci-fi uh, book, uh, kind of set in the future, so basically what's happened is a team has been sent to Mars on a rocket, and um, they had landed, they are doing all sorts of stuff until this huge storm swept in. And this storm um, caused the team to have to leave. But the main character of the book was running behind, and due to the high winds, a satellite had got ripped off from its hinges and impaled into his body. Not the rosiest of books. <laughs> um, but after he gets that taken care of, it actually goes really, gets really awesome. Um, he discovers he only has maybe give or take about 100 days left of food, and that's not enough for um, Earth to get back to him. So he then has to learn how to grow food on Mars. It's just a really good read overall. There is a movie which is a little bit violent. I wouldn't recommend watching it if you don't like violent scenes, uh, swearing, stuff like that, but um, the movie ties in really well with the book. So if you if you like the book, watch the movie, you know, like Netflix or Xfinity or something, but yeah. Overall, it's a really good read. All right, thank you, Tanner. Now back to the studio. Yeah. Thanks for that, Serena Farrell. You're welcome. Now off to a student council update with Senora Grotenice. Hi guys, I have an announcement about prom. So prom will be held on May 7th, that's a Friday, at 6.30 p.m. at Old Stonegate Farms, and that is in Nunica, which is kind of near Grand Haven Spring Lake area. Um, we're gonna begin selling tickets the Monday after spring break. Now those tickets are gonna open up first to seniors on Monday and Tuesday. We're gonna have you guys do that via a Google form. Once you fill out the Google form, you'll have 48 hours to pay at lunch. Tickets will be $30 each. And just a reminder that we're only allowing people from North Point to attend prom this year due to COVID restrictions and all of those kind of things. So once we give seniors two days to purchase on Monday and Tuesday, we'll open it up to juniors for Wednesday and Thursday, and then we'll be done selling tickets by the end of that week. So if you have any questions, just feel free to ask me or Mrs. Lambert. Thanks for that update, Senor G. Now spring sports have started. We've got baseball, softball, tennis, track, and girls soccer. Preview Day is coming up Thursday, April 15th, which is after spring break. Parents of visiting students must RSVP ahead. Talk to Mrs. Lewitsky if you have any further questions. Seniors, the Senior All-Nighter is coming up. Make sure you reserve your spot. Stay tuned for our final performance of the longest day of April. Now for Will the Weather Be Icky with Nikki. That's my cue. Good morning, NPC. I'm Nikki Brunick, and this is Will the Weather Be Icky with Nikki. Overall, this week we're going to get to about a maximum high of 68 degrees, so pretty warm. But at night, it will drop down to about 22, so make sure you bundle up if you're out at night. Overall, the week's going to stay about 50 degrees in the afternoon, so pretty nice week with some sunshine. We might see some clouds. I don't think we're going to see any rain, but you never know. Now, back to the studio. Thanks for that update, Nikki. Yeah. Now for the joke of the day. Have you read the latest book about anti-gravity research? I haven't. I could have put it down. Got something better? Email us at npcnn at npchristian.org. Well, that's all we got for today, NPC. I'm Nikki Brunick. And I'm Serena Farrell. Have a great fun day.